Today I'm doing small shopping in Sadar Bazaar, which is located in Gurgaon. It is a bit less crowded compared to all the daily bazaars and you can buy many different things. Uh, of course it's noisy. There are many tuk-tuks and motorbikes. Uh, but yes, definitely it's less crowded than in old Delhi. You can buy clothes, you can buy jewelry, you can buy, of course, Indian street food. And if you want to spend some time here, definitely this is a huge place. So two, three hours will be probably not enough. So yes, I'm enjoying today this bazaar in Burgaon. Hello. Ma'am. This is one year photo. Ma'am. Excuse me. One pic. गर्लीज़ है सारे नाइस है How much this set? How much? One hundred. Do you have with peacock? Peacock? Peacock with peacock. Uh, bracelet with peacock. <laughs> Thank you. 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 Thank you.
Are they in different size? Yeah, they have uh, different sizes. I need like this one bigger. as well Come on, come on. 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 Come
What else do you have to offer? What is this? Spring roll? Ah, what is inside? What is inside? How much? Twenty, one piece, twenty rupees. Okay, twenty or thirty. Twenty rupees. Shopping in Indian Bazaar is a unique experience. You need to have a lot of patience because there is a lot of crowd. Not only people, but motorbikes and little auto rickshaws. Sometimes cars as well, which makes your shopping really difficult. 
But yes, you can buy many different stuffs, you can buy material for your Indian dresses, as well as some grocery and Indian spices. So yes, this is something which each tourist coming to India should experience. But remember to, to be aware of someone who can steal some stuff, or will try to take you some different places. So be aware where you're going. Don't go to some corners in those streets. Yeah.